Hello, I am the Batman, and welcome to a tutorial. Nah, I'm just kidding. So, if you're like me and you use uh, Sony Vegas for video editing, then I'm pretty sure we go through the same struggle every time we import a fresh video into our project. Let me show you guys right now what I'm talking about. Random video. Uh, see these two tracks? These two tracks, uh, whenever you open them fresh from recording, uh, they're gonna have to build peaks. And those peaks turn into .sfk files, which save in your record recording folders. I can't speak. I apologize. And uh, they create a lot of clutter, and uh, they're not really that pretty to look at. You're here to hide these files, okay? So that's what we're gonna do. Uh, you go to your search menu, CMD, uh, type in the drive you're using, press enter, then pr type atrib. Atrib uh, plus H space asterisk, then the file extension, in which in this case is .sfk slash s, press enter, then you know, wait for this line to show up, close Vegas Pro real quick, I'm not gonna use that. And there you go. I did not delete anything. It's hidden. What? Uh, view hidden items. See? It's hidden. So that's it. Uh, real quick video on how to hide the .sfk files. But, side note. If you're done using that video, let's, uh, let's say I deleted that. View hidden items is still there. So, if ever you delete that video, you have to delete the .sfk files yourself. Uh, manually because it doesn't delete with the video itself which is pretty inconvenient I know but oh well, it's just a workaround another thing if you wanna unhide it just uh, change the plus sign to minus then any slash s there you go they're back just, let's just hide it again there you go Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. Love you guys. Hope to see you in the next one. See ya!